doing? Wanted to share a video with you. Um, a lot of people have uh, misconceptions about putting roof sprinklers on your house. Um, I'm a play it safe kind of guy. I'm not going to just sit back and wait for something to happen. So what I've done is kind of reconstructed, reverse engineered a little bit of uh, some of the expensive ones online. Um, this is simply a PVC three quarter inch um, apparatus. Um, it is 24 by 24 on both legs, on both sides, and the intent of this is to, when in use, these are actually plumbed together, and that will provide some weight and help hold that down to the roof um, because of its coverage and 24 by 24 um, with a little bit of about 7 inches, 8 inches sticking up on the sprinkler. Um, I don't think we'll have any issue with the the sprinkler actually discharging and trying to come off the roof even in winds um, we're going to try that but um, I bought this system um, pieces parts fittings even the sprinkler heads at 17 bucks a piece at Lowe's um, with the garden hose this is uh, some Amazon never kink stainless steel probably some it's not super great but um, I think seasonally in the rain season or fire season here um, I'm, I'm gonna be pretty happy with it um, again we've got the hose fittings everything's tied together all primered glued and I went ahead and threw a 